and welcome to my home. My name is Jackie. I have a bunch of things to unbox for you. So I got like a few things. There's like three things here. I don't really know what they are because, you know, obviously I never pay attention. I don't track packages because my mail is always so up in the air about when things show up. So let's open some bags. And I think I know what's in one of the boxes at least. And one I hope is one of the things that I do know is supposed to have been delivered today. And I'm like, you know what, that box didn't get, I didn't open that, maybe it's in the mailbox. So we checked the mailbox and there it was. I'm sure my mailman was like, our mail lady, mail person, was at the point that today was like, this woman gotta stop buying stuff, you know? You know when the UPS people know your name and the um, mail people know your name. Okay, so this is what I was waiting on. So this is a, a, an item I purchased to actually, uh, for a friend. Okay, so she, I bought it, she paid for it, and I'm going to mail it to her. So this is an eBay purchase. Look how pretty this is. It's on a cross grain. It's very pretty. Um, I don't know if you can tell the color, but it's kind of a purple. It's like a deep purple. It looks a little bit brown with the lighting. And this is the interior. Look at how beautiful this interior is. This is a notebook cover. So um, I have a bunch of notebook covers from Coach. None like this. This is an older version. So it has the card slot that has a little envelope slot here. So let's, and then let's see. Um, thank you for shopping at Coach. It's just a postcard. There's nothing really signif significant with that. So it's just a leather lined leather lined leather exterior um, beautiful I think this is a, considered an A5 um, it might be an A7 I, I get those two confused um, and then it has a little pen holder right here so this is this is going to be shipped out to um, her she lives across the pond so shipping is expensive but it's still cheaper for me to do it. So um, I told her all the time, like, if you want something, just send it to me and then I'll mail it to you. And we've mailed things enough now that um, we have it down, you know. So here's the other item. Now, I'm really hoping this is what I think it is. This one is from New Jersey. And this is also an EA purchase. So that um, agenda cover, it was an eBay purchase. And this is an eBay purchase. So you're like, Jackie. You and eBay. I know. eBay's been around for a minute. You know. We have a good relationship going here. No, my husband might not agree. Uh, but I think we're having a great relationship. Um, so far, I'm very happy. Very few things have I not enjoyed that I've purchased. Yes. Okay, this is what it is. Y'all. Y'all. Or Jackie, what did you order? Like... Okay, this is a little smaller than I thought. This might be too small. Yeah, it might be too small. Darn it. So I bought a lampshade for a candle, but I didn't look at the, at the diameter. So this might be too small for the candle um, I have for it, but um, that's okay. So I know the lighting is going to just be crazy. So it's like this, like a bisque type of let me turn off the second light there we go it's, so you can get a better look at what this looks like so yeah you can see the soot on the inside so this is for a Yankee candle um, it wasn't very expensive and it's just a beautiful rose motif and it says made exclusively for Yankee candles but I didn't look at the size so I did buy a Yankee jar candle so I'm not sure if this is gonna be too tiny but let me show you or let me um, find the <sighs> receipt let me turn the light back on so you have a little bit brighter let's see no there we go that's a better light I moved my lamp so I have a lamp right there so let's take a look see so the notebook cover was $26 plus tax and shipping and the lampshade was only $6. So I can't complain. Let me see the original listing. 
It just means I might have to buy smaller candles. I mean, really, hello, this is not a problem, right? I needed, a, I wanted a lampshade anyway. Um, let me see if it was just me not paying attention. No, there's no dimensions on here. Oh, here it is. Pretty matte fit ivory, finished ivory ceramic jar candle topper in a raised floral pattern measures three inches high by three and three fourths inch the widest. So I don't know. This might be too, this might be too, but I don't know. It might work out fine. I, I'll have to use it. And I do that because my, my, um, what do you call it? My husband gets a little nervous when I have open flames of things, you know, it's an open flame. I understand why he's nervous. So I just took a photo just to, for my review. Um, and I'll take a photo of this one for a review because um, eBay is doing something different now. You can actually put photos of items you purchase on your reviews now. And it's not live yet. It's still in the pilot project. So they're they're trying to have that available so when they when you can they can, you know, show it or whatever. So let me get the other thing. This one came from this is my last um, unboxing. So this came from Georgia and I don't know what platform I purchased it on until I opened the bag because I, I order on so many different platforms. I tend to have my favorites. I think we all do. Things I'm more comfortable with. Oh, okay. I know what this is. This is another eBay purchase. Um, a little bit of an impulse. This one was an impulse buy. This was just I, I liked it, I hearted it, so I don't really, I really don't buy things right off the bat off eBay. Um, I, I like things and I walk away. And then if you're lucky, the vendor will say, hey, if you really like this, I'll get this to you for a little discount. And then that's what happened on this one. So all three of these items are eBay, but look at this. I know I'm so predictable. This is a embroidered nylon Magic Kingdom tote. This is Walt Disney World, so it's from the park in Florida, and it is from 2005, as per the tag, and it has really cool um, long straps. This is really pretty. I still, I wish they still made these type of things. A lot of the stuff at the Disney parks are either, they're, everything at Disney is expensive, let's just be honest, but... The quality of this is amazing. For this to being from 2005, it only has a few loose threads. The embroidery is amazing. The condition of the bag is amazing. This might have been just one of those bags somebody bought at the parks and then never used again. So this says Walt Disney World. And so it was made in China. And I love this bag. This will be a bag I continue to use. And it's, it's almost in new condition. There's very little wear. I mean, the only wear on this really is some friction from that probably pops some of this embroidery. But to get this bag in this condition, I am so beyond happy and thrilled. I am, I was happy to find it. I'm always looking for tote bags. I'm always looking for Disney anything uh, to have embroidery, which is some of my favorite hobbies. And then to combine it with my favorite other hobby, which is Disney. Um, so speaking of Disney, my shirt, you know, Hunter Deer to Disney, Magic Kingdom. I am I have a Disney watch on all the time. This is my Sorcerer's Apprentice watch. So I am I pay homage to the mouse. Yes. You know, I actually have one more box to unbox. Let's just go ahead and open that too. I didn't realize it was still at my feet. I had done a bunch of unboxings earlier and this one got forgotten. Oh, I can't unbox this one. You'll have to stay tuned for this. This is a this is a swap video, so I need to um, do its own video. Sorry for the teaser, but uh, it's coming up <laughs> anyway. Have a great day. Thank you for watching my quick video on eBay. Have a great day. Bye.